in Galt to learn more about this property. Good morning. Good morning and welcome to the McFarland Farmhouse. Now, take a look. We are going back in time. 1876 is when this was built. But could, could you guess what this is? This little tool. Take a look at it. Does it look like anything that you might use? Women, I'm talking to you. Does this look familiar? Okay, I'm going to tell you because you probably have a hard time guessing. So this is a curling iron from back in the day. And so the way it works is you... Throw it in here. The fire should be going. You leave that there for a little bit. And hopefully you don't burn your fingers. You grab that, grab the hair, and you curl it. You know, we've come a long way. So I'm going to leave this here, tell you a little bit about McFarlane my, my Ranch. And I'm going to show you that photo right over here because, you know what, selfies are not a thing of the present. They're actually a thing of the past because that young man right there, McFarlane, is taking a selfie. Ron Jacobson, can you tell us a little bit about that selfie? Yes, that's a picture of John McFarlane sitting on the chair with the same chair to the right. And it's, we still have it in the house. And the, also the bookcase is original. And the fireplace are copies of the original. John, the picture up above, he's the one that named the city of Galt. And he came here in 1850 to buy the property, about 300 acres, and uh, built this house. And, and it, it just life out here. Now, you guys have been restoring, and it's an ongoing project. This place looks like, you know, they were just living right here, right now. Yes. Yes, this place uh, was the same, same family on the property ever since. That's why we have all original furniture, because they, the same family lived here. They didn't have to change furniture. They, they have two, three generations of the family lived here. How exciting. Now, this has eight rooms, and people can come and tour this place, really enjoy it, and, and take a look at it. Tomorrow, big event. Tell us a little bit about that. Well, they, uh, tomorrow is a big event. We're uh, uh, honoring Mrs. Hyenga, which is a grandniece of him. She's the last person who lived here that also gave us the property. One of the, uh, there you go. Yeah. There you go. So if you are in town, come, sh come by and check it out. That's happening tomorrow. We have all that information on our website. And for now, we're going to enjoy this place as we continue to tour it, and we'll send it back to you.